So the next day, when we headed to Piazza della Vergogna, where the official government buildings are located, and where the mayor's office is, unfortunately we were told last minute that because of a COVID situation, we could not conduct the interview in person. So we headed back to our room to prepare to do the interview on Zoom. Leo Luca Orlando has been elected the mayor of Palermo for three different terms totaling over 20 years in office. Although supporting different parties throughout his career, his main concerns have revolved around anti-mafia objectives in Palermo. May I tell you, first of all, welcome in Palermo. Grazie. Uh, Palermo is an exciting, safe, not expensive. <laughs> I'd like just to say that we are a fantastic city that uh, has strongly and deeply changed. And we have to say thanks to the mafia. <laughs> the mafia obliged us to open the eyes, the mouth and the ear. And my opinion is that the Sicilian became better after the mafia. Just like the German became better after Adolf Hitler. Palermo is the safest city in Italy. The safest city in Italy. One of the purposes of this show, and one thing I'm trying to establish is that we want to get rid of that stereotype. Every single time somebody does a travel show about Sicily, they talk about the Mafia, they talk about the Godfather, they talk about these same things. Oh my God. I've come here many times. I want to highlight all the other amazing the things that happen here. You got the Coppola, you got the Coppola. Yeah, the hat, yeah. yeah. The Coppola was stolen by the Mafia. Mm -hmm. yeah. the, the Coppola is used to cover the head. And the Coppola has become the symbol of the Mafia. When I was elected mayor, I just gave a red Coppola, a red Coppola, to the Cardinal Archbishop of Palermo. <laughs> gave just a, a grey Coppola to the Chief of Police. <laughs> Nice. And again, the white copper to the Pope. <laughs> Give me a fantastic letter of the Pope. My dear Mayo, I understand the meaning of your gift. It's one way to say that you are proud for your identity, but I'm sorry for you. Since 2000 here, the Pope used another, <laughs> another hat. <laughs> I cannot, I cannot wear your... <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I have actually one really sort of serious question I want to ask you, and um, it's just something that's really important to me, and um, I need to know um, where in Palermo I can get the best canola. <laughs> <laughs> well, uh, in your opinion. Allora, I am the mayor. Yes. <laughs> Being the mayor to say to you everywhere. Yeah, everywhere. Everywhere. <laughs> everywhere. everywhere. Okay, okay. <laughs> just say, just say that you must be careful when you speak about food, because you risk just the life. Eh? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and if you have to go there in Via Bacchera, there are thousand arancine. Thousand. All the different days, my opinion, the best is a very simple one. The best is rice, butter, and nothing else. Ah. You have to go there. If you ask me, may I have an arancino? <laughs> <laughs> the man says, I'm sorry for you, we have no arancino. <laughs> thousand, thousand. <laughs> We're going to represent your city in all of its beauty and, and vibrant colors and life. We've been filming and just having a, a great time here. And we look forward to uh, showing the best of Palermo to the rest of the world. Fine. Okay, Thanks Mayor. So. Thanks so Grazie. much. Grazie. 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 Hey, and enjoy Arancina. <laughs> <laughs> Grazie, Sindaco. Buona serata. Grazie. Thanks, Grazie. Thanks, Grazie.